and one. Tired of wiping on the same boss for hours? Die, insect! Can't seem to win against that new druid deck? My thanks to you. Are your teammates not standing on the payload? Quit lollygagging, get on the payload! Well, grab a drink and pull up a chair. This is the Game Case Show, your Blizzard Entertainment Podcast. Here are your hosts, Cuddles and Turarts. Well, hello, hi, howdy, and welcome to episode 106 of The Game Case. I am Chris, also known as Cuddles, a brewmaster monk, who is now level 110, what? what? On Airy Beak in the Convert to Raid Guild. And I am Turts, a Beastmaster Hunter in the Convert to Raid Guild, also in the Airy Peak server. Woohoo! This week, we're going to talk a little bit about our year in review for the Game Case Show. We're going to talk about some of our 2018 goals. So, first off, let's let's talk a little bit about gaming. We it's been a while since we've since we've seen all these wonderful people. See what have you been doing? Well, that it has. So yeah, December was you had Fubo, and then just the holidays fell poorly this year on holidays on weekends. So it's been a while. Um, I have been warframing it up. I love the game. Very fast paced yet familiar. Um, I keep comparing it to WoW, and people are like, this is nothing like WoW. I'm like, well, here's the thing. It is a little bit, so just shh. It's fine. It's okay. Um, but no, Warframe is amazing. Um, Dibble dabbled in the desert map in uh, PUBG a bit, and uh, holy hell, too many hiding spots, too many craters, too many things. Not good, but it's fine. We'll get there eventually. We'll just play it more. And then Warcraft, because the CTR Guild... It's going to be hitting five years here in like a week and a half. So what? All things that. It's so exciting. Um, hard is it really leave. that close? I didn't realize it was that close. When yeah. does this happen? What what day do the festivities begin? Festivities? We kind of have a precursor event this year. We're doing a um, raid recruitment event next weekend. Okay. So next Friday night and Saturday night we'll have raid recruitment events. And then officially events will start kicking off on Sunday. Um so if you are in the guild and you're looking for some fun stuff to do, guild.convertterade.com. Yes. Or convertterade.com backslash guild, I think is what I still use. But <coughs> head there. Um, and if you want to, just go to convertterade.com and check out the hard work that was put into that brand new website that they rebuilt. It's pretty awesome. Yeah, they did a, they did a phenomenal job. I actually I, I jumped over there today and took a look. It's pretty incredible. It doesn't it's, look like forums out of the early 90s anymore. The forums are actually locked. You cannot do anything with them anymore. They are done. Signals Media All-Star forums. All gone. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. I use them a ton. That's okay. <laughs> That's sad. Now we have Discord, which is so easy to look back and find previous conversations and useful you- for threaded thoughts. Discord feels like it's been around forever, but CTR didn't actually jump onto the Discord chain until August of 2016. Like it's wow. only been a year and a half. That's it. No, that sounds about right. And I do, like, I love Discord, but I miss the, like, the one thing that Discord's missing is that forum style, like, the ability to find a thread of thought. And actually, like, I feel like Discord is very, like, ephemeral, almost like Twitter. Like, yeah. you say something and a week later it's gone. Like if if you did if somebody didn't see it, it may as well have never happened. Cause who's who gets on there who gets on their Discord after being like out of a Discord for like a week or two and goes, Oh look, five hundred plus messages? This will be a fun half hour and like actually reads all of them. The only ones I do that in are <coughs> the CTR officers, the CTR CTR guild one, the you are not alone on ours, and then the the rambling on ours otherwise if anything else if i see it's more than 20 i'm just like nothing important scroll back to the bottom we're done yeah i have there's very few i went back i went back through one of my team ones um today and went back through like two weeks of stuff because i i just forgotten about it because there's like everybody has a discord um the search is yeah the search is okay but you better know the exact phrase that was said 
Did you add emoji movie things? I don't remember that from before. Emoji movie things. They move on your screen. Oh, on the screen? That. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we have we we have it's the old um the old Kappa gen. So any emote that somebody puts in the chat shows up on the screens. I need to get that fanciness. It's super easy. I can it's probably a button. Okay, okay. Well, um, we'll talk. You'll have to you'll, about... you'll have to use stream elements, but it's super easy. I think I have that. I think. So you use stream elements and you set up an overlay like you were going to use their horrible horrible overlay tool. Um, and you just set up the only thing that's on the overlay is Kappa Gen. That's um, it. <laughs> and then, yeah, and then, and then, and then just, yeah, emotes everywhere. <coughs> All the Excuse emotes. Me. Well, what about you? Like I said, it's been, I think, a month since we've, we've been on here and done this. What have you, what have you been gaming or doing? Well, I have been, uh, I've been playing PUBG, of course. Um, finished up Rides of the Tomb Raider. Um, what else have we been been doing? Stellaris, been doing. I'm I, I'm having to like go over here and look at my vods just to see what I have been playing because it's been, been all over the place with games, which is awesome. There's there's been there's just so much to play, and I feel like every day it's like, oh man, when are we gonna play this again? I'm like, well, after we play this and that and this and that and the other thing, and um, H1Z1, I started getting into that a little bit. Um, the the precursor to PUBG. And really enjoyed it. It's a, it's a lot. It's just as glitchy, but a lot more polished. <laughs> if that makes any sense, like it seems to run a heck of a lot smoother. But you're still going to drive a car through a guy, and it's not going to register. Um, and of course, um, a little bit of World of Warcraft. I actually I buckled down. I got cuddles up to one ten. I think we're around eight eighty eight ninety with gear. I don't know. Maybe that's crazy. Maybe I'm at like 720. I'm not sure. Um, somewhere in there. <laughs> yeah, somewhere between 300 and 9,000 is where my um, where my exactly where it fits. But no, other than that, just uh, there's been a lot of new um, like streaming software coming to the uh, coming to the market, and so I've been trying out Bebo. I've been trying out Slobs. Just kind of messing around. Had some computer issues. Went down from two PCs to one. Um, it's been an interesting kind of like month or so. Um, and then of course the holidays, like the holidays were great. Got a Nintendo switch. Um, so I've been playing through, um, legend of Zelda and it was one of those, like, I was like, I could set this up and I could stream it or I could actually take some time to myself and have like a single player game experience. And I've been doing that and I absolutely love it. Like I'm, I'm really, really enjoying having like a game that's just mine that like I just it, but it's funny because I still like I talk to myself still oh yeah or, like I'll have my kid come and sit next to me so I can talk to him <laughs> while I'm playing and come over here and be my chat I mean spend time with daddy and yeah it's uh I don't know it's it's a whole lot of fun um but how were your how were your holidays Good, good. Super quick. We um for the first time ever we did Christmas at, <coughs> at our house. Usually um we on Christmas Eve we go stay the night at my parents. And so for the past five years my parents have been able to do the Santa Claus thing and Miles has been there to open presents. But this year we actually did it here. Um Miles loved it and then Santa left him a note saying that he left presents at my parents' house too. So they still got to uh do the whole Santa Claus thing there as well. Um but no, that was great. And then New Year's like fell asleep at 12.01, so I definitely partied hard. Um, but yeah, they're done now, thankfully. It's just a lot of travel. Lots of nice. Travel. Nice. That's what our... Uh, we didn't get to do a lot of travel this holiday. It was like everything was right here. So that was that was pretty cool. Um, so what about what about your, your favorite... Let's, let's dig into a little bit of, uh, of 2017 before we yes. jump into what's coming up in 2018. In so what's going on? Like favorite episodes, guests, moments. Like what were some of that? Because this was – you know, like, and I, this is so sad. Like did you come on in 2017 or did you come on in 2016? I came in October of 2016. Like you had me as a okay. guest on a show. It was the show right before we had Zia on. So sometime in October or late September, you had me on. And then jokingly, you were like, I need a, need a co-host. And I was so 
okay, Monday's off, and then bada bing, bada boom, here we are. Um, so yeah, 17 was my first full year, and 17 is when I started booking guests. Woo! Like January 1st was guest booking. Um, but yeah, no, it was, we got some, and you've had big names on here before me, but I mean, we got Scott Johnson on, um, Dr. Bean, we had a ton of streamers on, um, Mick Montgomery was back after his move to yep. league. So that was really fun. Um, no, we had a lot of good, and we hit episode 100, which was fun. We didn't quite make eight hours cause I was dying, but that's because I don't stream for more than like two hours at a time. So anything more than four is like, oh my God, what is happening right now? Um, yeah, no, I think we had some we had some pretty big milestones. Not that you weren't doing amazing before I came along, but No, you you definitely like you took the show to like another level. And that's why it went it was very much like at the at the end, like as I was bringing you on, it was very much like, oh crap. It's um, you know, it's it's nine fifteen on Sunday night. I need a guest by ten. <laughs> Who can I scramble and find? And it was just like it was a matter of time and being able to hand that over to you and your your stewardship of that responsibility has been incredible and amazing. We did like this this last year was pretty damn awesome with guests. And we expanded <clears throat> from just wow to Blizzard Entertainment. So we were talking about Hearthstone. We didn't get we didn't get StarCraft on there or really Diablo, but we got Overwatch. We got your favorite heroes on there. Um, we well, need to get Leviathan. <laughs> we should get Leviathan on here from um, from West March West March Workshop. He was uh, he was on a panel with me at Calm Before the Storm, and he was a really really cool cat. And I don't under 